Welcome back to our educational videos. This video will help you use the documentation tools in the new workflow screens. You will still be able to use the Power Note. However, we have changed its name to Documentation, as shown on the link here. You will still keep the same note types and favorites. In addition, we added a new tool for documentation called Dynamic Note or Dynamic Documentation, which is accessible through the new workflow screens or by selecting the option from the Power Note choice box here. Now let's show how it works. In the workflow screens, you will be able to type or even dictate components of your notes such as history of present illness, physical exam findings, and so on, through categorized data entry toolboxes as shown here. It's very important to mention that you can use the auto text option while typing, which can make your data entry very smooth. The main feature of this dynamic documentation tool is its ability to extract all these different node categories you have typed or dictated earlier and assemble your note in one click. In addition, it will also collect the most recent labs and vitals. You may also tag labs and they will automatically pull into your note. The other data that can be tagged from previous note, this data will not automatically pull into the note but can be dragged and dropped into the desired section as shown here. It is worth to mention that it will also sort the active problems you selected using the problem list here and place it under the assessment and plan section. Reviewing notes became also more user-friendly. You can simply review the content of each note with one click as shown here. If you double-click, it will open the whole note for you. In our next video, we'll discuss the new Smart Order Entry option. Thank you for watching.